Hi everyone, this is Chris at Chris Marino Design and in this video we will learn how to create triggered animations from a single button in Adobe InDesign. Shout out to Prelude for the comment and children's book idea. Alright, let's get to it. In Adobe InDesign I have a document consisting of three parts, a full background image, six vector music notes imported from Adobe Illustrator, and a transparent circle over the large music note which will be our button. Next I will go to Window, Interactive to select the Animation and Buttons and Forms windows. With the Buttons and Forms window selected I will click on the circle above the large music note and choose Button from the Type drop down menu. I will leave the name as Button 1. Next I will click on the first music note Select the Animation window and choose Fade In from the Preset drop-down menu. Then I will click on the small icon button to the right labeled Create Button Trigger. Once selected, my cursor will change to the icon and now I need to click on my large music note button. The Buttons and Forms window will now show I have an animation triggered for my first music note. Next, I need to select the animation window again and click on my first music note to make a few adjustments. Once selected, I will deselect On Page Load from the Events drop-down since I only want the button event to trigger this animation. Then I will adjust the duration to half a second. I will repeat these same steps for the remaining music notes while increasing each duration 0.1 so the final music note has a duration of 1 second. So music note 1.5, music note 2.6, note 3.7, note 4.8, note 5.9, and note 6 a full second. Once complete, we can preview our document to check if the animation works correctly. I will click on the large music note button which will trigger the smaller music notes based on our set durations. I can also re-click the large music note to trigger the animation as many times as I want. Everything looks great, so I'll click on the share button to publish online. I will rename the title to Digital Children's Book and hit publish. Then I will click on View Document and now my animation is ready to be viewed online. And that's it. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and learned something new. And I'll see you next time.